Hey guys, this is Matt, and this is my Winter's Tale review. Now, my girlfriend Jessie came up for the weekend. I love her so much. Um, she came for Valentine's Day, and we wanted to see a movie, like a romantic movie together. So we saw Winter's Tale. That was like the only, there was like a bunch of um, romantic films that came out, but Winter's Tale was the only one that really intrigued me, like caught my attention from the trailer. And I hear it's a really popular book, so I really want to read the book now after seeing the movie. So the plot is about um, Colin Farrell plays a thief named Peter Lake, and um, he he. Um, attempts to rob a wealthy mansion, and he finds the daughter of the wealthy guy, and they're played by Jessica Brown Finlay, who I've never seen before, but she's in Downtown Abbey, and I hear she's really good in that. They fall in love, like usual, and um, she has consumption, so she, eventually she dies, and um, the film the film starts in 1915, but it moves forward in time to 2014. And um, it's a, it's a, it sounds a little weird, but... um. The whole, it's because of magic, like, there's magical elements, fantasy elements, um, just a lot of stuff. So that's why it's intrigued me, it's, it's not your regular romance film. But, um, yeah, because, like, there's, like, angels and demons involved later on, but I'll get to that later. So anyway, um, there's a whole theme of, like, what happens when we die, and, like, the theme is, like, we, once our time on Earth is done, we go, we turn into stars, and that's eventually what happens in the end. Um, Colin Farrell's character, once his time his mission on Earth is complete. He goes and turns into a star, or whatever. Very. It was a very bittersweet ending. Like it was happy, but it's like still depressing, a little bit. But it was fine. Um, Russell Crowe's in it, so it was, yeah, he plays like he plays the main villain. He's a demon, which we find out later, which totally shocked me. I was not expecting this whole angel and demon aspect of the film, and I, I liked it. I liked it. <laughs> and Will Smith, he, I heard he was in this. I don't know. I didn't know what role he played. He, I hear he has a cameo. He's in two scenes, very two short scenes. He plays Lucifer, the devil. Like, why? You couldn't find a better actor? Like, he didn't do a bad job, but he felt so out of place among all the people. And even behind me, I'm like, someone's like, oh, Will Smith? Like, when they first showed him. I'm like, yep, I agree with that. Yeah, he plays Lucifer. Some okay role. Like like I said, he felt out of place. They could have find, They could have found another actor that was not him. <laughs> but he, that was a surprising role for him so a lot of great actors have played lucifer in the past but he's not one of the great ones let's just say that so yeah you can definitely just from seeing lucifer you know it's a heavy angel versus demons theme throughout and it, it kind of is we only see like one angel i think one angel character throughout the whole thing but it the current themes like in the background somewhat but yeah there's other elements involved there's reincarnation there's miracles there's destiny and this it was just good i liked the mixture of the two um the scenery was gorgeous. Anything of like winter, time of winter, I love. Like any scene, there was like a scene where in the like they're in the woods and all the trees are covered in snow and there's a lake with snow. It's just gorgeous. Um, I thought it was pretty solid. I didn't. It's not the best movie out there, but um, it's it definitely entertained me throughout. It's like two hours long. It entertained me. Good romance movie. Uh, I was I was um not bored at all. So it was good. I don't, a lot of people are hating on it, but I don't get it. Like it's not bad. It's definitely not bad. I don't think. And I know a lot of people love the book, and I know, I think they changed some things from the book, I don't know, but that's probably why people aren't liking it that much, but I liked it, so give it a chance if you want, um, if you like a romance, not your regular romance movie, I'd give it a shot, yeah, I had to see it, Valentine's Day weekend, we had to see some romance movie, so, yeah, alright guys, um, my next review, I don't know what it will be, I really don't, um, I'm almost done seeing all the movies I need to see for Oscars, I have four left, and two of them I don't know how to find. I don't know how I'm going to see them before, but I'll find a way. So I'll see you probably next weekend. So you guys have a good day. Bye.